We're going to start the day right out here in the kitchen with a lesson on cooking salmon from Chef Robert Maggi of Armani's. Good morning, Good morning Chef. How are you doing? Save it in the morning. We like it. I was going to say, hey, I can get on board with about anything these days Definitely. when it comes to food. So, uh, Especially if a chef from, Ar from Armani's is cooking uh -huh, it, right? Uh-huh. I am digging this. And I'm quite intrigued what you are making for us today because oh. we've got, what, bacon and salmon. Oh, yeah. It's got a nice <laughs> locked door salmon in here searing off right now. And then we have a starts of our fava bean ragu here. Tell us what you guys are doing and kind of what you um, like to keep on your menu we're there. More of a mo uh, we're trying to be more of a modern Italian. Mm -hmm. uh, right now we're a little northern Italian, which is more stews and everything. So I'm trying to add in like salmon here. Of course, it'll be Sicily uh, or more seafood and everything. So we're trying to add all that into there. Just kind of recreate it a little bit, mm -hmm. you know, modernize it and, you know, get everybody really hyped about Armani's again. Yeah. So, yeah. I'll say again, though, the location. We got a first touch <laughs> oh, yeah, on it. I mean, definitely. that's a great location. Oh, we're at the Grand Hyatt Tampa on uh, the Courtney Campbell, a 14th floor, all, you know, windows all the way around. Can't find a bad seat, so... Definitely. And a bad, and I'm sure you cannot get a bad meal either. Oh, so yeah. let's break down what we are. Our, uh... So we got our bacon in there. We're gonna throw in our leeks. Um, gotta have the garlic. We're... Ooh, that's a healthy portion of oh, garlic. Yeah. Oh yeah, you gotta have <laughs> some Are you some a big garlic. fan of garlic? Definitely, I have to have a garlic. Garlic and bacon, probably in mostly everything. You know, it adds some really nice flavor to it. So we're gonna add a little tomatoes in there. Little cherry heirloom tomatoes there. Tell us that for our chefs at home, maybe our wannabe chefs at home, what is the trick? What's your trick, do you think, to cooking salmon? Um, I would say definitely starting with a nonstick pan okay. if you're starting out because starting with a, like a, th this pan here, regular for a salmon, it's probably not going to be the best. You're going to get it sticking too much. A good trick for it um, is always to make sure you have enough salt on the skin side. Oh, really? Or even season your pan beforehand. If, you're, if you don't have a nonstick and you can't get to one, definitely season your pan. Just add a little salt and olive oil to it get it nice and hot and then you throw it in there and it's it'll definitely help it from sticking and don't play with it don't that's play big, with it don't, don't that's the biggest thing don't move it because you're like oh it's sticking or no or you know you don't you're leave not sure it. yeah leave it alone let it go and i noticed we added bacon but this is a relatively healthy uh, meal it, it for people actually, right yeah, especially yep. maybe another yep. stereotype that italians get that well, their, their the, cooking isn't so healthy definitely because everybody always thinks pasta pasta yeah. pasta yes, kind of yes, think yes. outside the box <laughs> yeah. you gotta think a little outside the box a little bit there um so we're gonna go ahead and throw in our fava beans to finish this off Ooh. so there comes another health element there how do you describe that bean? My family eats a lot of lima beans. We're big fans of that. It kind of looks similar. It's but very, very similar to it. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely. Um, I would say it's the closest thing you probably yeah. can do it. Yeah. I just um, hear Anthony Hopkins' voice in silence. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we talk about oh, yeah, and we're showing the Chianti on camera. <laughs> yep. See, I'm, I'm just feeling silence of the lambs all around. <laughs> but look how beautiful that looks. All well, that the color. colors. Yep. Yeah. You always got to cook with your eyes a little bit too, more than just uh, just mm -hmm. your flavors. You know, you got to have the flavors there, of course. But you, you, everybody sees the dish, and if they don't like what it looks like, they're not really gonna, mm -hmm. you know, go for it and like the flavor. So it's got to look pretty, just as well as got to taste beautiful. You know, it's looking really good over here. Uh huh. Uh, Creme <laughs> that you brought here this morning, which this is the first time that I've seen it in a jar like that, which is interesting. Yeah, that's something different that we actually do. Um, we actually, instead of cooking it in a water bath into the oven, we actually take our creme brulee into a glass jar. And the awesome thing about this is you can take it to go. You know, if you're out and you've been out a little while uh -huh. and you, know, you had your dinner, you're good. You want to take it to go and, you know, have a little intimacy at home with it. Perfect. Creme brulee is always the best. So I'm going to go ahead and throw this on plate here for you. Oh, yeah. It really is there. a good looking dish. Oh, yeah, definitely. I like that we touched on the, uh, <laughs> gotta treat the eyes as well as. Yeah, you, you always have to, because if it doesn't look good, you know, a lot of people aren't gonna go for it. Like, ah, it doesn't look good. Even though it may taste awesome, you mm. know, some people are gonna be like, no, I don't think that, look, you know, it doesn't look the best. Well, that's like with cookbooks now, and I think even when you find recipes online, I wanna see a picture of what it's supposed to look yeah. like, mm -hmm. and, and then see what mine what usually you. looks <laughs> yeah. like, and they're quite different, <laughs> but yours looks right on par. Oh, awesome. All right, Great so we got stuff. our salmon on there. Salmon adds color too with your sear and everything. Um, we're gonna go ahead and add, this is our lemon thyme butter that we add to it. Oh, that's cool. So, you know, adds a little bit of more richness uh, just to your salmon. And I have a little uh, amaranth I brought along. I already had them picked a little different colors on the top just to add a little more to that presentation. Wow, That's thank it. you so much. This is awesome. Thank we can't you. wait to dive in. You even bought the, the oh, I brought and everything. knives, so yep. we'll go ahead and divide this up. Chef, Definitely. thank you so much. Oh, thank you, Appreciate thank you. It.